Oh, I'm not going to pronounce that one. That's not going to go easy. So when you get a box from UPS that says it's four pounds, see, right there, four pounds. And it's from a cigar manufacturer. Kind of makes you wonder what's inside. Well, let's find out. What's going on everybody, I'm Cigar Show Tim and I'm gonna unbox this package that came delivered by UPS a couple days ago. I was out of town doing some different things. I'm back in town, but it piqued my interest because one, it says it's four pounds, so it's not just gonna have a couple, you know, cigars or a hat or something like that in there. There's gonna be some substance to what's inside this. And it's from Villager Cigars. So let's open it up and see what came. And yes, Boy Scout knife. Boop. That's what happens when your boys are in Cub Scouts and Boy Scouts and you're a leader. And when you work for them too. Minor detail. So let's get this opened up here and see what we've got. Knife safety. Don't cut yourself. Okay. It's like... Was that noisy enough on camera? There. Paper's gone. So we have got a good sized box here from Villager Cigars. It says cigars since 1888. There it is right there. Let's open it up and see what we've got here. Oh, nice. Really nice printed sign. Making a cigar is a precise craft. Composing its flavors, composing its flavor is an art. Both craft and artistry are our tradition since 1888. Heinrich Villiger. There's that right there. I chose up great. Look at that. Boom. Then the backside shows looks like cigars from their line. I wonder if that's what's in here. And this has the really fun, like, packing stuff that's, you know. Too bad it's not New Year's coming up. All right, let's dig into this. Dump. Dump. All right, we got a three-pack bundle here of cigars. Actually, I'll go through that in a second. We've got a fresh pack. We've got what looks like... Zycar and Jetline, so I'm guessing cutter and lighter. Maybe, maybe. And looks like last but certainly not least, yeah, that's paper. That's the bottom. Okay, box down. Vilger Export, short on time, big on flavor. So their Export Series is a box press cigar. It's one of the world's best sellers. Made from fine Cuban seed blend with a high quality wrapper, rich, slightly sweet, and very smooth for a unique small cigar experience. The classic features a Sumatra wrapper. Ooh. The Maduro has an Araparaca wrapper, and the Brazil is a Brazilian Puro with a Matafina wrapper. So there's that. Here's the fresh pack. So you can see all the cigars that are in there. And I'll open this up in just a second. And then this is a three-pack bundle that looks like, I mean, it's the cigars, the export series that they were just talking about. Variety pack, limited edition, Swiss made. And there are three different ones. It looks like there is, well, time to use the knife again. Looks like we have Yep, there goes that. We've got the classic. We next have the Maduro. And last but not least, the Brazil. Let's take that off. Those are all three of the export, the smaller box press cigars. 
And then inside the fresh pack here, we have five different cigars. We'll go through them real quick. And yes, this is review material. Don't worry. We have got, try to keep them in order because I'm OCD like that. All right, working from left to right inside the bag, we have the Villager Sandoro, Colorado. Right there. Next up, we have the La Flor de Inclan. I'm butchering that, I apologize. La Flor de Inclan. Sure, we'll go with that. Then next we have the Libertad. Right there. Number four is the, oh, I'm not gonna pronounce that one. That's not gonna go easy. Uh, but it's the Connecticut Cream. We're gonna go with that because the name that's on the band, I am just going to butcher if I try. So there's that right there. And then, oh, this has the same name on it. So yeah, I'm just going to show you. And this is the Black Forest. You can see that right there. I'm going to grab the card that I tossed out because I need the information. So entertain yourself. I got it. Okay. Got the card. We have the... Sandoro, Colorado, ranked number 15 in the top 25 cigars list by Cigar Aficionado in 2018. Uh, then we have the La Flor de Inclan. Inclan? Inclan? Oh, on the band it's got an A and on here it's got an E. I'm, I'm just reading it the way it is. Ranked number 10 in the top 25 cigars list by Cigar Aficionado in 17. And then we've got the uh, La Libertad. Uh, made at the new Villager de Nicaragua factory. Uh, and then we next have, I'm going to butcher this, so just get ready to laugh. The Villager Cuellar Connecticut Creme, Cream. Uh, and then finally we've got the Villager uh, Cuellar Black Forest. C-U-E with the, you know, accent on it. L-L-A-R. So, Yeah. But if you want more information about these, I'm gonna hold that up right there. You can scan that QR code and go and get all the information on all five of these cigars. So you can see there's tasting notes, there's all sorts of stuff on this card for it. So if you want more information, go to villagercigars.com. And there's the front again. Really well done. Nice card stock, very, very nice. So let's put these back in here. And I will say the fresh pack still nice and soft not dried out at all so let's throw these back in here well we won't throw them we'll lovingly place them and then here and I actually have I think another villager in my humidor that I haven't checked out yet hmm, maybe so that is what came oh and I forgot over here so we have a jetline box and if we open that up I can get it. There we go. The Jetline Rogo is what it shows. That's how I'm going to pronounce it, Rogo. And it is a... It's got some weight to it. Very nice. Villager, the world of cigars. Got a lighter. I would try and get it going, but of course, it has to be shipped empty. I did that just, you know, to prove that there's nothing in it all right and last but not least we have a zycar box here and inside it we have got a zycar this is the uh, x i i believe it is straight cut villager right there you can see it very nice focus 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 maybe maybe not there we go there we go Really nice looking. So I've got some review material and you'll be seeing this coming out on my channel uh, in the very near future. But I wanna say thanks to everybody over at Villager for including me on their 
uh, list of content creators in the industry to um, to have check out their product. So look for more material, content, whatever you want to call it on social media, whether I'm just posting a picture, enjoying one, whether it's a review, whatever it may be, uh, I'll be going through this and content will be coming out uh, courtesy of Villager Cigars. So if you haven't heard of Villager or you haven't tried them out before, go to villagercigars.com and you can get more information. And don't forget the QR code that I held up a minute ago, you can rewind because it's down there again and I'm not going to pick it back up. So anyways, thanks everybody at Villager for sending this out. I've got some content coming up and uh, yeah, enjoy your cigar journey. I'm Cigar Show Tim. As always, I'll see you.